Hi guys, good morning and it is the first question of uh, today's bi-weekly contest. All the questions I should say was pretty easy except the last one. Last one was also easy. It's just that the implementation in involved lazy propagation on segment trees which was a bit tricky to implement. But yeah, we'll see all of them. So yeah, let's move on to this first question which is maximum difference by remapping a digit. It just says that we are given an integer nums. So we are just given an integer nums and you know that some name Mithal. Yeah, uh, we'll sneakily remap one of the digits from 0 to 9 to another digit. Okay, so basically he will remap a digit, let's say 6 or any number to any other number, let's say 8 or any other number. So from X, it will remap to Y. One digit. Uh, return the difference between the maximum and the minimum values and uh, he can remap like he can make by remapping exactly one digit in nums good so what we are do uh, what we have to do is that we have to remap let's say a d1 to d2 and like all d1s to d2 uh, all occurrences of d1s to d2 now the number is of length like 1e8 it can be of length 1e8 okay now good let's see one example so basically here is the number and we want to return the maximum difference between the so we want to return the difference between the maximum and the minimum values which means the maximum value possible minus the minimum value possible so what we, we can do is here if we want to make this number as maximum which is 11891 so if we want to make any number as maximum let's say i give you any number if you want to make it as maximum if let's say if i gave you these places and i want and i ask you hey can you please uh, make this number as maximum so when you think of maximum you will start writing 9 at this place right then you will try writing 9 9 so basically you will try writing 9 in the first place to maximize its value so what we do here also we do here the same we try to maximize the first digit which is we will replace that one which is at the front with 9 so with this how we are maximizing it as we are maximizing the first place as 9 we are replacing it by 9 so we are maximizing it and as we have to replace every of these ones by 9 so we will replace these ones by 9 all of these ones are replaced by 9 it is how we maximize it because it's standard right we just need to place a 9 to maximize in the starting what if it it had been a 9 itself which is in the example 2 if it is 9 itself in the starting, so it's no point to replace a 9 with a 9 itself, right? So what we will do is we will replace a next non-9 digit with a 9. So we will move on to this whole string. Let's mark it as a string for now. And we will move on to this whole string. We will see what's the first non-9 digit. We will replace that non-9 digit with a 9. So it will be, it will become a 9 and this 0 will replace by 9 so now i showed you how to get a maximum number so now let's see how to get a minimum one to get the minimum number what we can do is we can just simply see if i just showed you that okay it is a number right now and you want to minimize it so what you will do you will just start placing zeros right for sure so here also you will do the same thing if this is 11891, so you will just start placing zeros at the first place. So it will become, now you will replace all the, that first thing with a zero. So it will become a zero, zero, eight, nine. And for sure, as one is being replaced by zero, all the ones will get replaced by zero. It will become the minimum. As you can also see that it will yield a maximum of 9989, which is the maximum and a minimum of 890 which is the minimum and here also in the same in the example we will try to replace the foremost digit with a zero so it will become a zero zero right we change the foremost digit to a zero so now you can see easily see that for maximizing i will replace i will move on from the left i will replace or i will choose the first non nine digit and I will replace it to a 9. For minimizing, I will just choose the first foremost leftmost digit and I will replace that by 9. It's the only thing which we have to implement. Let's see the solution now. 
is simply same as what I explained. I just transferred that number to a string so that it's easy to iterate on that string. Now I got the first character. It's it's like nothing useful because here I just need to get the first non nine digit because later you will see that I will replace my s which means that now I will make another string which is the maximum string here this string s1 is the maximum number so to make that maximum number I need to replace that c which is the first non 9 digit with a 9 so I will replace this c as you can see in this loop what here I did I, I just found a first non 9 digit and I just marked it as c here I will replace that c wherever the c is occurring I will replace that by 9 as you can see and rest I will just copy paste as it is for the string s2 which is the minimum number I just see what was my first uh, leftmost digit I will just see what my first leftmost digit and I will just replace that by a 0 in the whole string and last I will convert both of those string into numbers and return the difference and it's all I hope that you guys like the video and see you guys in the next video until then bye bye